Leonardo AI is a stunning new tool that uses artificial intelligence to create video game assets, environments, buildings, and concept art. Video editors, game developers, even content creators, man, can use this free tool right now. Get your content looking way more professional. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Let's just jump right into using Leonardo AI, man. So to get started, man, you do have to join the early access whitelist. I mean, to do that, you just sign in with your email and you have to put in your name and things like that. But, you know, Crypto Quam family has already done that. So let's jump into Leonardo AI. Bam, so as you can see, we're jumping into Leonardo AI. They have different tools here, such as AI image generation. They have uh, the AI canvas, and then they also have texture generation, man. Texture generation is a huge new tool, and we're just gonna jump right into using it right now. So right here, as you can see, I have an OBJ file that I uploaded. This is basically an RV slash food truck. So as you can see here, I gave it a prompt of basswood, and this is what it came out with. Very, very nice texture around the entire OBJ image. Very, very nice. But let's see if we can go even deeper. So we're gonna ask it to generate the texture of tree bark. And this is this generation will take 10 minutes. Whoa, five minutes. So we're gonna return to that in a second to see if it can create a tree bark texture for it, us. But while we're waiting for that, let's just look at some of the other stuff that we can do with Leonardo AI. So as you can see here, man, AI text to image generation is honestly crazy. This person put in the prompt of a gentle, beautiful girl with messy red hair. What did they put for the background? They said a little smile, open mind, depth of field, clean images, high quality, and this is what Leonardo AI came up with. So let's just use this ourselves, man. Just changed her hair to blue, and then we also put futuristic background in the prompt. So let's see what we get generated. Wow, as you can see, man, we get an entirely new image generated. This is pretty sick, man. I like this girl. She's pretty cool, anime inspired. But let's just start off with our whole new, new prompt. Let's see what we can get. Whoa, as you can see, man, we have our AI generated image. Very, very sick. Cool Nissan GTR in the background. The anime girl is even cooler with her long sword. I love it. I love it. I was born purple in my cup mace window. It's gonna work out, be together if it's meant to. I was going back, man. You can obviously see the creations of other artists here. Lots of cool creations. And you can use this to do anything. As you can see here, a realistic girl, 27 year old female. That's crazy. Wow, let's see if we can do this. Create a realistic male. loading not really as realistic as this as the previous prompt to be honest this definitely looks like an ai generated person but very very nice image to be honest here man there are a bunch of featured models that you can use up at the very top we have dream dream shaper 3.2 this model by lichen is a great range of portrait styles as well as artistic backgrounds vintage style photography this model can generate a broad range of imagery with vintage style that is cool you can also create your own ai model man so these models right here were created by developers like you and me man not even developers just content creators and creators like you and me man so jump right into it you can definitely create your own featured model which is crazy I have the AI canvas editor so you can basically edit your images within Leonardo AI which makes sense man you're you're gonna create images with Leonardo AI you might as well be able to edit them as well so that's very very useful that they have this tool within their app as well as prompt generation which is a new new tool that just came to Photoshop AI so it's very promising that uh, Leonardo AI has it already built into their editing software and 
it was a huge, huge deal when it came to Photoshop AI. So it's very interesting that not many people know about this in Leonardo AI. As you can see, man, we're starting off in the editor and we just gave it a random prompt. And these are the four renderations of a blue Dodge Charger that it gave us. So yeah, in my opinion, this is a very, very good alternative to using Photoshop AI and Midjourney AI. Instead of using two different apps, man, you have one app built into one. You have the AI canvas, which is essentially your editor. You have the texture generation, which generated this basswood right here, which we can go back. This is actually very, very, this is actually a lot better than the prompt that was just basswood. So we have the tree bark, which gives it a lot more detail and texture, in my opinion, all around. So yeah, you can play around with the texture tool. You can play around with the editor. Without further ado, man, that is Leonardo AI. It's essentially a powerful AI video editing and video creation tool that you can use, man. Instead of using multiple apps like Stable Diffusion, uh, Midjourney, Photoshop AI, without using all of those apps, you can just use this one app. Without further ado, man, this is CryptoQuam Family. We're on the road to a million. We're talking all things cryptocurrency, artificial intelligence, and technology. Please join the road to a million. Without further ado, I'm out. This would it be seven million one hundred thirty-six thousand dollars? Apple Vision Pro is here. XRP Ripple decided to go crazy this week. This must actually be, as a matter of fact, Ripple. They're like, why you sipping green? Like you never play. Put a presidential like deal. Hey, <laughs> but this ain't a rental. I'm off. He like, how you know my bitch? That's from way back. And I used to whip the Ford like a Maybach. And